everyone technometry with the video for you guys now if your cellular is not working after the ios 26 update you want to follow these steps to fix it so let's get started first thing you're going to do is pull down the top menu or pull up from the bottom so you can put your phone on airplane mode briefly and then turn it off 10 15 seconds you can also do it from your setting turn on airplane mode and then turn it off and go ahead and check if your cellular is working now the next thing you want to do if it's not working is in the settings go to general and then about and then wait in this about page to see if there's a carrier update if there is it's going to say update carrier and you click on update now if you don't see anything pop up like mine that means there is no update so we're going to move on to the next step the next step depends on the type of phone that you have so if you have a phone with a physical sim card you need to go ahead and remove the sim card so take a sim ejector tool or a pin or paper clip and then locate the sim tray usually it's going to be on the left or bottom here you're going to look for the sim outline and go ahead and insert the tool and then take the sim card out see if there's a sim card there here i don't have a sim card for example i'll go ahead and put my sim like this now if you happen to have this is key important thing is a dual sim two trays you want to move it to the other part if you have one sim and it's not working on this one take it to the other slot again important fix if you don't know I don't have this I can't show you but that is a fix some people have found is that if you have a dual sim again switch the sim to the other spot and then insert it back in and that should go ahead and fix it for you now if it's not working and if you have an eSIM and no physical sim what you want to do is go to your go to your cellular and then you're gonna go ahead and basically turn off the line there should be an option that says turn off line and then turn it back on and that will also sort of reset the sim itself so go ahead and try that now if it's still not working the next thing you want to do is in your settings go to general and then go all the way down to transfer reset iPhone click on reset and you want to do a, basically a network setting reset so if you do a network setting reset it will reset your network setting it will not delete any of your data but again important step to do now let's say that didn't work for you the next thing you want to do is follow this step you're going to quickly press and release volume up volume down and then hold on to the side button until the screen goes completely black and the apple logo appears so i'll do volume up volume down then i hold on to the side button just like this and just keep on holding that side button don't let go until the screen goes completely black and the apple logo reappears so i'm going to wait here for the apple logo to appear and i let go again this method is known as a forced restart it will not delete any of your data again the process here is to quickly press and release volume up followed by volume down and then hold down that side button until the screen goes black and then the apple logo appears and after that hopefully it is fixed for you now in a case that none of this worked for you, you just need to contact your carrier or the company that you get phone service, let them know. Sometimes they might need to reset something on their end as well or push out an update to make sure your phone is working. And I hope this video was helpful, so please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. We'll see you guys next time.